The ocean is one of the deepest and most unexplored parts of the planet, with an unimaginable number of undiscovered species and mysteries. However, studies conducted over the past few decades show that this magnificent environment is actually under serious threat from human activities and intervention with plastics set out to outnumber fish by the next few decades. As you can see, every single day more and more plastic is being accumulated in our oceans. According to M. Remon, in his study 2013, more than 100,000 marine animals were killed by plastic bags every year. And these are just creatures that we managed to find. It comes at no surprise in the last decade, we had adverse effect on the health of human beings and some incidents have attracted the attention of the entire world, putting a question mark on the viability of the use of plastic in our daily lives. Marine life is suffering irreparable damage due to the plastic waste according to laura parker at national geography millions of tons of mismanaged plastic waste is dumped in the ocean each year a look into the long and short-term consequences of polluting the environment with plastic waste its effect on marine life and threat to the human welfare the situation surrounding plastic waste accumulation in the oceans and other and other water bodies of our planet has never been worse than it is today. To take a closer look at the situation, let us, let us look at some statistics. According to a study conducted in a review of environmental economics and policies, Around 300 million tons of hard plastic gets manufactured every year, of which around 50% are single-use products that are just thrown away. These plastics take around 500 to 1,000 years to degrade. Wow. And only 9% of plastic is actually recycled. Not just that, but according to Rinko Verma in a 2016 study, by other plastic disposal methods, such as the air, is affected in a huge amount, huge amounts of carbon monoxide, and other toxic gases are released into the air every day, which in turn causes global warming and change in climate, as well as serious organ damages to humans when inhaled like lung cancer or stuff like that since these plastics take so long to degrade we can expect most of it to end up being washed back on shore at some point in the next few centuries <clears throat> we forget that there is an entire habitat of species that depend on this resource for their survival Species that call these water bodies their home. This constant and ever-growing accumulation of toxic and harmful plastic waste is causing unrepairable damage to the marine life. According to a 2020 study by G. Dashari, around a thousand species of marine life get impacted by ocean pollution. And now we have over 500 locations that have been recorded as dead zones where marine life cannot exist. There has been an alarmingly significant increase in the number of dead marine animals being washed up on shore in the, in the past few decades. These deaths occur due to plastic waste that are just thrown in the ocean. With all of the negative effects of single-use plastic that are widely known and, and acknowledgeable around the world, the question then remains, why is, it, is its use so popular and how does it get in these marine habitats? 
The fact is, plastics are used so widely because they're quite easy and cheap to make. And they can actually last a very, very long time. According to Ketsanavakis in marine debris, most plastics enter our ocean bodies and marine environment from merchant shipping, sewage outfalls, commercial fishing operations, and even beachgoers. Another big source of plastic pollution are large industries which improperly dispose dispose their plastic at the sea. Due to this overwhelming increase in water pollution in the form of plastic waste, marine life is severely impacted and their survival is threatened in an ecosystem that is no longer suitable to their survival needs. This also has a significant effect and severe implications for human beings and their health. Single-use plastics are among the biggest contributors to the sharp increase in water pollution. Over the past few decades, these plastics take centuries to degrade and their disposal is not environmental friendly in any case. Plastic pr- products such as straws, shopping bags, they just get stuck in throats and stomachs of the animals and are causing them to be on the brink of extinction even. The only way to reduce the impact of these materials on their environment is to be mindful of their disposal and to look for alternatives for plastic. Thank you very much for watching.